So let's just underline all the commands. <clears throat> and you can do italic, uh, italicized text, so on and so forth. Um, so we'll just do that real quick just for a little exercise. And I think this is the last thing that we want to do as far as the drawing goes. Um, okay, so there's our, our text text block. Okay, so let's go and um, I'm not sure what to call this. Let's call it widget. And our scale is 1 to 4. Okay, I just clicked on the viewport. You can see it's 1 to 4 here. There we go. So 1 to 4. Oop, not 43 for sure. And uh, type in the date. And then drawn, <coughs> drawn by your three initials. Or if you only have two, that's fine as well. Uh, we don't know any other information. So the last thing I want to do is to create a PDF of this. So we'll go to the inventor, I mean the Auto, AutoCAD application button. And then go down to print, plot, and we want a PDF. Now remember we've already changed our page setup pen table to monochromes. Alright, so all we need to do, by the way, the only thing different than what we're doing here and printing to a printer is we're selecting the PDF as the printer. Um, so if you have an 8.5 by 11 at home, um, you can print to that as well. But for this exercise, we're going to create a PDF. Um, Okay, so just select OK. Usually you want to preview, but we've already previewed, so OK. And then you want to tell it where you want to save it. And by default, it will put in layout one. If this is only one drawing that you're printing, I'll just take that out. So the name of this file is scale measure in text. And let's just call this widget. All right, so there's our um, uh, completed. No, we don't want to update. Uh, completed uh, PDF, okay, with all the required information. And uh, I hope this helps you out and clears up a, a few lingering commands that we've had from this uh, this semester. And that concludes this video.